All right, everyone, next up in our handstand prep progression, we're still doing some uh, hanging variations for shoulder mobility um, without loading the wrist and the shoulder and the neck quite as much. Uh, we just did a two leg straight leg raise and now we're gonna try one at a time. Okay, so these, uh, I've mentioned in a previous video when we just did knee raises, these asymmetrical movements are good for pointing out your asymmetries. So if you have issues with uh, one side feels tighter than the other one, maybe one hip flexor feels tighter than the other one, maybe when you squat, you turn, or when you're doing your handstand, you turn, you probably, and I would guarantee it, you have some sort of asymmetry that's driving this. And a little bit is normal. It's okay, you don't need to freak out about it. But it is something that we can kind of look at and try to improve to get a little bit more symmetrical mobility for your symmetrical movements like the handstand. So we've got a hanging and we're doing one straight leg raise at a time. So I round my back, I get my abs, I start my plank and then I go one. Try to keep the other one straight down. Yep. So you might feel your body turn a little bit. That's totally normal on that one. I just want to make sure I'm staying secure with my abs. My hip flexors are doing the work, but they're not. They're lifting my leg up, but they're not doing everything. They're not stabilizing my spine too. For that, I have my abs, okay? So that is the hanging, alternating straight leg raise.